to my channel if you are new on my channel please don't forget to subscribe after you watch this video i'm going to show you how you can create a youtube thumbnail using this photo app on your iphone or ipad you go to the app store on the search bar type in p h o n t o photo so we click on the second line photo text and photos click on that photo text and photos open okay so this is the screen where um, we are going to make our thumbnails on the bottom part you will see the camera click on that hit on the plain image oh, you can now see this square black screen you click on that and we have to customize the measurement on this thumbnail for the youtube thumbnail we use 1280 width and 720 height so we click on the um, measurement on top and click custom so with the width we put one two eight zero and the height should be seven two zero and done okay we have to save this screen click on the square box with the arrow pointing upwards that's the save button so click on that and click use okay so the next step that we're gonna do is to click on the three vertical lines on the left side of your screen below the screen add image I'm going to go all, to all my photos and then just pick my photos um, the, just pick the first photo I'm going to use I might use I might use this one I like Nemo I love Nemo okay there you go you can actually change the shape of the photo you like see that yeah. oh, wow this is how this is why I like this app okay but I'm just going to um, um but i just want it on its original size so click done i've got my first photo now i'm going to resize that you see the uh, minus and plus sign it this is to increase and decrease the size of your photo okay the size let's say i'm going to the height to fit on the screen well, you can actually use this as well okay but I prefer to use the plus and minus button five okay let's say hmm. okay let's right i'm just going to resize the width to make it a bit bigger hmm. right okay now i am going to add another image this one oh, sorry I've got a bit of runny nose there because um, it's so cold in it's cold here in Australia at the moment we just use this photo I might put that in here resize that so the size of the height before was 561 so I'm going to set it on 561 as well Okay, 
Hmm. Okay. We're getting there. We're getting there. Okay. Right. Going to change the width. La 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 la. I plan to put three uh, different images there. Okay, go back. I'm gonna go. In, I'm going to add my third image. This one. Done. Right. I'm going to put it on the middle. Height is 561 as well. Okay, come on. Just be patient, guys. Oh, you can actually uh, increase it or decrease it the way you want it, but uh, you can, just like what I said, you can use the um, scroll, uh, what you call it, scroll button. You can actually use this, or you can actually decrease, or you can actually resize the photos by tapping on or holding on tapping or holding on the plus and minus um, button so let's just ching side okay I think that's I think that's too big Yay. doesn't matter if it overlaps but I would like to make that just exact fit on the middle screen okay okay and the height is 561 okay let's resize put that in here now, I've got my three images for my thumbnail. So what I'm going to do now is to save these photos. Save image. Okay, I have to go back on um, photos where I saved it. Go to the... Sorry, that's how it looks like. Now, we're going to use this photo um as a thumbnail we have, so we have to go back to the photo app click on the camera photo albums and we find that photo that we just saved a while ago okay so done now we're gonna add a text click on the photo and add text I'm gonna name it as a maybe diving experience. Let's say diving experience. Oh, let's say let's say my diving experience. Okay, you can change the alignment for the title. It's either you click on align left or right or the center. And you can change the font as well. You can click whatever font you prefer to use. It's there. But I would I would like to leave it as that. So done. And my text is here. So it's too big, right? So don't worry, you can resize that. Size. And you can change the size by doing this. Or the plus and minus button okay right I might put it big I might um yeah I might uh, make it bigger okay you can actually change the color of the text if you go to um, text style change the color uh, you can change the color background white and text 
let's say yellow red okay oh pink yeah I think that's looks a little bit better okay mm. okay done this is how my thumbnail looks like you can add more photos you can change you can actually customize um, your text so on your title you can actually tilt it so if you want to look at like that if you want it to be like that way okay I might just put it once you're done and you're happy with your thumbnail you just save this and save to image okay so let's have a look how it looks like go back to the photo there is my thumbnail like my short video tutorial on creating YouTube thumbnail using this Fonto app. So like this video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up, comment below, and subscribe, and hit the bell button to for you to get notified on uh, my new video. Anyway, guys, um, have to go now, and uh, always remember, in everything you do, just be yourself. Stay connected guys and God bless. Mabuhay. Thank you.